four research trends related to the lifespan of modern science. The problem of prolonging a person's life regardless of age has been a concern of all people and in recent years a lot of research has been conducted on this problem in modern science. First of all, some of the representative contents are briefly introduced and the first is genetic characteristic as a congenital factor. So first of all, according to genetic characteristics, human life spans have slight differences among races, households, genders, and individuals, but it is a fact that humans basically have a certain life span. Secondly, it was found that environmental factors and diet problems have the greatest influence as acquired factors. Therefore, it's a fact that the lifespan is affected by radioactivity, ultraviolet rays, harmful waves, and various chemical pollution levels as environmental conditions. In addition, in the diet program, the intake of calories is the most directly related to the lifespan. First, it was found that the ex excessive intake of calories and the increase in weight increased the incidence of adult diseases and shortened the lifespan. Conversely, however, animal experiments have also demonstrated that limiting caloric intake can delay growth and prolong life. In particular, it is known that in the case of a high intake of fat even among calories, the onset of adult diseases and tumors is accelerated and the lifespan is shortened. Third, as a result of experiments related to the lifespan of the cell dimension, when comparing the cell division ability of cells separated from the tissue of the animal by the number of cell divisions, the longer the animal, the longer the number of divisions, and the longer the period. Therefore, it has been observed that cells of a rat that can live for three years can divide about 21 times, but cells of people who live more than 70 years can divide 50 times. In addition, experiments also reveal that the number of divisions differs according to the age of cells in one individual. Therefore, in the future, it is assumed that, assumed that it is possible to develop a method that can measure the health status and the remaining lifespan of all of the cell with the ability to divide cells. Fourth, aging is gradually promoted due to defect or error in the message transfer between genetic factors DNA and RNA and protein synthesis. This is because all the differentiation and growth are achieved by the genetic factors at force, at birth, and all characteristics of the body are maintained. But during the long period of time, a small error occurs gradually in the process of message transmission and reproduction. And this error is gradually expanded. Eventually, they will die by not being able to regenerate normal healthy cell tissue. Fifth, aging is accelerated by the accumulation of waste products such as metabolites, fat oxid, oxide, and denatured proteins. So the aging phenomenon is that the cell function begins to deteriorate due to the accumulation of waste products. 
and thus as the accumulation of waste product increases, the cells eventually age and die. 6. Aging is promoted by the creation of cross-sync substances of glucose and protein-based substances, thereby promoting various adult diseases and weakening immune function. In addition, free radicals also promote aging. 7. According to a recent researcher in France, the ex existence of a kind of steroid hormone, DHEA, a substance that delays aging, can play a role in suppressing the aging phenomenon in the human body. It said that, it said that an effective method for extending the lifespan will be developed. In addition, to the content described above, we are studying aging and the prolonged lifespan in a variety of ways, but there, is, there are no prescriptions to show the remarkable effect. However, the results of all these studies can be a good reference, especially the relationship between caloric intake and lifespan, fat intake, body fat and weight, and aging and the accumulation of waste products, gene transfer, ETC. It seems that there is a direction in healthcare for longevity.